Okay, you've heard uh, of ghosting in a relationship, right? Yeah. Yes. Where you're seeing someone, and then all of a sudden they just disappear. And you're yeah. like, uh, <laughs> have you heard of cushioning? No. no. <laughs> it's like, cushioning, is, it's a dating technique where, you, along with your main piece, you also have several cushions. Other people that you can chat and flirt with, just in case your main squeeze disappears. Oh, like oh. people on the back burner. Yeah, yeah, having someone ready to go. Yeah. Oh. Oh, yeah. I don't think that's good. That's, you know, sometimes you just need to make out and the person that you're seeing isn't around. And if you're not like official with the person you're seeing, you're just sort of hanging out and there's nothing wrong with making out with someone else. But to, so the cushion softens the blow, as it were. So yeah. if, if something blows up with your main <laughs> squeeze, then then you have someone ready to go. Right. But I think that if you're going to do this, make sure that you're not, make sure that the person you're with knows that you're not official, that you're all allowed to be seeing other people. Otherwise, it's just oh, cheating. See, I don't think that's a part of the equation. Oh. Right, but right. that's just cheating. I'm not into it's that. It's the shoulder to cry on, I guess, kind of. Like, if the person dumps you, then you turn to that person like, oh, I'm feeling awful about myself. Oh, no one wants and to be then, that person. Know, <laughs> yeah, I'm just kind of wondering, like, how many people listening right now, you probably don't want to admit it, but, you, okay, admit it. You do have someone waiting in the wings. Just in case, mm-hmm. just in case things go south with the person you really want to work it out with. Is cushioning, are you like actively fooling around with your cushions or are you just keeping the cushions around for like a little ego snack and then you'll use them if you have to? Does it say? Well, it's, it's the just in case guy. Okay. So it's like you keep them around. They give you, you a little ego snack. You text and then, them. You chat with them. And then like if something happens, then you're like, oh, hey, all of a sudden I find you attractive. Right. Let's have sex. It's more like pre-cheating. Gotcha. Oh, you, 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 you might think it's harmless, but if you found out the person you're with was doing it, you'd have a problem with that. Yeah, stringing people along on the side. It, it, it wouldn't be so innocent if they did it. Yeah, isn't that funny? How you feel you can get away with something, but if they try to get away with it, no. Like I think we should see other people, but you shouldn't see other people. Mm-hmm. I should just see other people. <laughs> isn't that funny? How that works? I know someone who was married. She was in a relation, like, married, and um, she told her husband. I want us to have an open marriage. I want to see other people, but I don't want you to see other people. Oh, okay. <laughs> and he had so little backbone that he said, okay. Are you serious? What? Oh, yeah. What? It was oh, a that's mess. not good. It oh, was a mess. I'm that's sad for him. I knew, yeah, they divorced. I knew somebody who, he, she lived with the, her husband, and on he would say to her, hey, I'm going to my girlfriend's house. And she would say, okay. Really? <laughs> Let him go. How odd. And yeah. then he would come back, he would come back later on, and she would be fine with it. Uh, yep. Hello, Emily. It's not a good thing when you find out that you are someone's cushion. No, it is not. But at the time, I was actually kind of okay with it. So, okay, so you knew that you were second place. I knew I was second place. and You're the understudy. Yeah, I kind of was, but it was fun at the time, so I didn't really really mind it that much. Was Hmm. there anybody else in your life? Like, were you seeing somebody else, and then that person was also your understudy? Um, at the time, no, because I was broken up with that person, but apparently they were still into me, and that was not going all right with me. You know what? I wonder how many people are the cushion, and they don't even know it. Oh, yeah. You know what I'm saying, Emily? Oh, oh I bet. There's like, probably so many people. <laughs> like, they think they're the main, right? but it's actually like oh, the cushion. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I remember a time oh, yeah. when I, I was told, oh, no, I'm leaving him. Uh, we're done. Oh, yeah. And so I was like, okay. But then it turns out, you know, they're, they're married now. Oh, God. <laughs> Hello. I mean, I was, the, I was the cushion. Wow. Look at me. I'm a cushion. No. Before you stand a, a cushion. You deserve to be a main, Elvis, not a cushion. I don't want to be a cushion. Oh, I want to be the whole damn sofa. Mm-hmm. Oh, I completely agree. Uh, well, thank you for calling us, Emily. Have a great Monday, okay? Thank you. I just want to tell you guys, I have a two and a half hour drive to work every day, and you guys make it so much better. I love that. I love your long commute. All right, Emily, now you make us want to actually go to work. We'll go to work today for you. All right, thank you, Emily. Have a a safe drive. Hi, Katie. Hi, Elvis. So you have a ton of cushions. Now, why do you need cushions, Katie? Um, You know, I'm not sure. It's just kind of, they're always good. You you know, you have a little fight, go text them, and like, you know, they always... They make you feel good. All right. I mean, so so you have a main person you're with, but you have others ready to go just in case. Yes. All right. So does it ever make you wonder, like, how real this main thing truly is? Yeah, a little bit. Because, you know, like, everything. if anything goes a little rocky, it's like, oh, I text my one cushion, I text my other one, you know, keep it up. 
Look at that. Making me, put me in a good mood. All and, right. you know. Well, look, we, I guess you could call that dating around. Yeah, I guess. I, know, are I you... like to be cushion though. Okay, are you... okay, cushion more cushion for the pushing. Yeah. What? All right, well, thank you, Katie. Good luck with that. Thanks. All right. So, okay. Yeah. I, you know, and they're good for if nothing else, making you feel a little better. Like she said, like I have a buddy who we just that, every once in a while we'll just reach out to each other and flirt, 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 and then that's it. We just need a little ego yeah. snack. Well, that's one thing. It's another to know you can go there. Like if you're in a main relationship, yeah. And ego snacks always waiting for you. Yeah. Huh, what's scary? What if you are the cushion? Man, I've been the cushion. I've been the doormat. Where you just sit there and you're just kind of like, okay, I'm just going to take it from everybody. And then, mm. you know. Oh, scary. Well, like Savannah. Hi, Savannah. You were the cushion. Hi. But you were in oh, love with the guy, God. though. You were a cushion in yes. love with the guy. Yes. So I wasn't actually in a relationship with him, but I, like, fell in love with him. And he treated me like... The cushion, like, whenever the girl he actually wanted to be with was, like, not around, he'd come mm. to me and be, like, all sweet and stuff. And I'm like, okay. Well, you, you kept it, you just kept waiting for him to leave her for good, and he never did. Oh, no. It took mm. me, like, three years mm. to get over that. <laughs> that sucks. Did you finally, though, you finally figured it out and moved on? Um, kind of. You, you never get over that one person, you know, you... You've always got that one person you always will have feelings for. Yeah. Even though they were crap to you. Yeah. Oh, yeah. honey. All right. yeah. Hang in there, Savannah. You deserve better than that. You know that. I I just want to let you know I love you guys so much. Listen to you every morning. Y'all are great. Well, you deserve better than that. And thank you for listening. Would- no, you don't deserve better than us. <laughs> I mean, you deserve better than the, the guy, but you found the perfect yeah. show. But do you have another show as your cushion? That makes me a little crazy. Wait, I, I can't handle I can't handle that. Right. Thank That's you, Savannah. Yeah, I, I have to... We have to be your one and only show. We cannot tolerate you seeing a cushion. No No. cheating. No No cheating on us. What the hell is that all about?